Spider-Man Far From Home trailer came out and it's absolutely amazing and today we're going to break down all the important parts and we're going to give you some things that are related to Avengers Endgame as well. Coming up. Hey guys, what's hey guys, what is going on? Welcome back to the channel. If this is your first time here, consider subscribing because we make short videos on Marvel and we make theories, predictions and we answer your questions from the comment section below. Now, our videos usually range from 2 to 4 minutes long, but since we have the trailer and we have some easter eggs to break down, I hope this doesn't stretch too long, but I've tried my best to keep it short by breaking down only the most important parts. Once again, subscribe if you love Marvel. Let's go to the trailer now. You don't want any part of this. Alright, so now when Mysterio comes, we see that he actually has a pretty heroic entrance. And for those of you who don't know, Mysterio is actually a hero in this movie. But I believe that he's the hero and the villain, and I'll get to that in a bit. So, if you don't know, Nick Fury actually hires Mysterio to fight the Elementals. And before I speak about his him being the villain and all that, look at his suit. It seems as though it's taken from the Chitauri technology. And well, we know that Michael Keaton's Walter is in the movie as well. So there are two things that could be taking place. One is that during the events of Spider-Man Homecoming, Mysterio traded some of the Chitauri technology with Walter. Or the second possibility is that he gets this technology in Far From Home itself. And this resembles the Chitauri tech a lot, so I think he gets some of his powers from there. And also, you can see that he emits that green smoke, and I think that this is some other alien technology, or one of Mysterio's illusions. If you don't know who Mysterio is, he's Quentin Beck, who's a special effects artist in movies, and he uses illusions and various other chemicals and technologies in order to come out as Mysterio. And about him, he's actually a villain in the comics and he wants to be a hero by defeating Spider-Man and then joining the Avengers. Now, I think the similar thing is going on in this movie as well. And common sense would say that Mysterio is actually involved in the creation of these elementals. Now, hold on. Some of you may think that these elementals are just illusions, but think again, if Hydro-Man or Hydron could emit such a huge blast of water to Spider-Man that took him aback, how is it an illusion? It actually had an effect on him. So the answer is yes, Mysterio has indeed created these elements, and they are real, they're not just illusions. So let's move on to the final part of the trailer. In this final scene, I am going to talk about Mysterio's fishbowl helmet and this image appearing as he shoots those gases. Alright, so when Mysterio came out, he didn't have his helmet and now he seems to have it. So what I think is that this helmet is nothing but a source of protection for him whenever he's battling. So it's just like the Iron Man faceplate, it just comes down when he wants it and it just goes back up when he doesn't. So I think this helmet works in a similar way. Nothing much to explain but it's pretty cool we saw Mysterio with it. So next is when we see Mysterio attack Hydron or Hydroman, we see him shoot out these green gases and as he does so, we see that a triangular image appears on his hand and it has a dart at the center. Now many of you are going to say this is the Illuminati but it's no, I'm going to shut that theory down, it doesn't make sense with Marvel here. We do have an Illuminati in Marvel but not the one who wanted to change the world order and all of that. That's a different Illuminati and this is. So, what I think is, if you guys remember, when Doctor Strange uses the Time Stone, you can see some circular image with a triangular pattern in the center. So, I'm not saying that this is connected to the Time Stone, but what I'm trying to say is that this may depict that there's some new technology used by Mysterio. Now, Michael Keaton's Walter used the Chitauri technology. Now, if you're introduced to a new alien species in Avengers Endgame, why isn't it possible that Mysterio uses their technology to fight these villains and probably fight Spider-Man later on? So this image may depict the presence of that technology used by Mysterio. So that's what I have to give you about this image. Let me know what you think about this in the comment section below.
There you have it, true believers. That was the fantabulous trailer we had from Spider-Man Far From Home. It was actually better than the Endgame trailer because it had more fun in it. And if you guys want more Marvel, if you want your Marvel theories, predictions, and major questions relating to Endgame or Far From Home or any other thing, then please consider subscribing by clicking on the fiery logo you see right here and click on either of the videos to continue watching. I'll see you next time. Peace.